So Drupal's own slogan is that it is community plumbing. And so for you to have a community, you have to have multiple users, obviously. So let's talk a little bit about users. Um, you can have a you can set up your site in the configuration so that people can register themselves as new users. You can make certain things be visible to anonymous users and have only some people have to log in. Um, or you can um, have it so that you invite, in fact, right here, you can invite people to the site. Uh, here we have a very simple, here's because this is a simple site, we only have two users right now. That is me, and um, by default, because this is in Drupal Gardens, we have an admin named Gardens Admin. So um, uh, you'll see here that I have two roles. I am a, an administrator and a site maintainer, so that kind of says the kinds of things that I should see and do when I'm logged in. I can edit myself. Um, I could, because I'm an administrator, I could edit other people too. Um, and I can say, for example, if I'm active or if I've done something bad, I can I like block, I don't know if I can block myself, I guess not, but I can block another user. I can assign myself to other roles. Now roles are, um, we'll talk about more in just a second, but roles are, well, why don't we talk about it right now, are things that people can do. Um, site maintainer, an administrator, an editor, a blogger, an authenticated user. Um, the authenticated, these are built-in um, roles right now, but you can add your own roles. The authenticated user is someone who's signed in. The role that we don't have listed here is anonymous user because you can't be signed in and be an anonymous user. But those are kind of the built-in roles. You can add ones to that. For example, um, graduate assistant or a um, uh, person I haven't seen in a while. Um, these are all, you can just kind of make up your own roles as you go along if you needed to. Um, and then we have some some details about this particular person and and um, and um, where they are located and and bits and pieces there. Um, and we've got a bunch of things here, my follow links, etc. All right, so let's look at the people. I've I've closed it off. Let me bring it back up. We also have a set of permissions, and the permissions are based not on individual users, but on those roles that I talked about before. Anonymous user, authenticated user, blogger, editor, administrator, site maintainer. These are th the things that each of these people can do. And along here you have a bunch of uh, modules like add this and also kind of built-in modules like comment and block. And then the, the sorts of actions that are allowed by that. So for example, you probably wouldn't want an anonymous user to be able to do what we were just doing with blocks a minute ago and administer them. But you could, you could let them do that if you wanted to. Um, for example, in comments, maybe let's say right now, administer comments and settings, um, edit own comments, post comments. Right now, anyone can post a comment, right? It's checked all the way across the bot. But if we wanted people to have to be, have an account and log in before they could comment, it's one click. And now anonymous people can't, um, they can view the comments, but they can't make a comment. And as you can see, there's a lot of permissions on here, and you don't have to usually go through and deal with a lot of these, but it allows you to do some very fine-grained controls on what, uh, who can do what and under what conditions. And as I said, is if this isn't enough number, if, if I'm sorry, if these aren't enough roles for you to be able to um, create, to fine tune that, you could actually create a, a role for a single person if you wanted to. Um, you could add in a new role for um, alien being. And maybe that alien being you want to be able to do only one thing, right? Um, and uh, Let's take a quick look at the permissions again. I go back to the permissions. Now we have an extra column here for alien beings, and maybe alien beings are only allowed to, uh, let's see, uh, they're only allowed to post comments. No, they are by, by default because anybody can. Um, edit own comments. So alien beings are the only ones, and nobody else is allowed to edit their own comments. So you know, you can you can be very detailed in in what kinds of things people can do or can't do. Um, we'll leave it at that for now. Uh, there are ways of having pro, especially in in Drupal seven profiles for each individual user, but um, you can kind of discover that on your own.